Hey guys, this is Rex here with Apple Toolbox, and I'm sure I'm not the first Mac user to see this screen. You know, you wake up, get a fresh cup of coffee, you're ready to get to work, and then you're stuck here. It's frustrating, I know, but let's walk through a few things you can do to get up and running again. If you've booted up your Mac and gotten stuck here, after you've heard the chime, keep your fingers crossed that it's just a simple software hiccup that can be fixed easily. If you've got a problem with your hardware, the fix is probably going to be a bit more extensive. So the first thing you should do is try to boot up in safe mode. Mac OS X, 10.2 and later allow you to boot up in safe mode, which will automatically check your disk and repair any issues. To do this, shut down your Mac and power it back up while holding the shift key. You can let go of the shift key after you see the Apple logo. Keep in mind that safe boot will take a little bit longer than normal, but once your Mac fully starts up in safe mode, go ahead and restart it normally. If booting up in safe mode didn't solve any problems, you can try to pinpoint the issue by running disk utility. To do this, hold down the command and R keys while powering up your Mac. A Mac OS X utilities window should show up. From here, you can go ahead and select disk utility. Next, click your OS X hard drive and then select First Aid. Once you run this process, Disk Utility will go through and verify then repair your disk. Another thing you may try is resetting the PRAM, or Parameter Random Access Memory, which stores some of your system settings. To do this, hold down the Option, Command, P, and R keys at the same time while booting up your Mac. Once you hear the startup chime, you can go ahead and let go. Your Mac will then reset the PRAM, and then it will restart completely. In most cases, one of the steps I've covered so far will fix your issue. If they haven't, you can always reinstall OS X. Now you can reinstall from the Mac OS X Utilities window that we saw earlier. So again, to get there, you're going to hold down Command and R while booting up your Mac, and instead of selecting Disk Utility this time, you're going to select the Reinstall OS X option. Now it'll ask you a couple of questions to make sure that's what you want to do, but once you go through this process, OS X will be completely reinstalled on your Mac, and this should fix any issues that you had. Now once again, if you do have a hardware issue, then none of these software tips are going to help. You're probably going to have to set up an appointment at an Apple store and see if they can help you out, and there's always a chance you may just have to buy a new Mac computer. Anyways, I hope that at least one of these tips helped you guys get your Mac up and running again. Let us know in the comments if you like this video content and we will certainly do more. Also check out the article we published over at appletoolbox.com. We'll put a link in the description. It has a couple of other more in-depth ways that you can possibly fix your Mac if you're stuck on a white screen. Well that's going to do it for this video guys. I appreciate you watching and I will see you next time. Later.